In the 1920s and 30s, two Oklahoma farm boys were slugging their way into baseball history with the Pittsburgh Pirates. They were Paul and Lloyd Wainer from Hera, Oklahoma. Paul and Lloyd were probably the first two major league players to come out of Oklahoma. As a matter of fact, they were actually born before in Oklahoma, but before it was a state. And this is actually in Paul's word. Tulsa Jim Knight is a fan of the Wainer brothers. They were his great uncles. He explains that Paul Wainer joined the Pirates in 1926. He weighed less than 140 pounds, but was a great hitter. Younger brother Lloyd joined the team a year later. For 14 seasons, the Wainer brothers powered the Pirates. They were such fearsome hitters, they were known as Big Poison and Little Poison. They're the only brothers in the Baseball Hall of Fame, which is pretty amazing. If you think about the DiMaggio brothers, there was three of those, and Delaney brothers, there were five. The two Wainer brothers have more hits than all of the, the other brothers together, so pretty amazing. They were amazing ball players, but Lloyd Wainer, Little Poison, had another talent. He took home movies with a 16 millimeter film camera, getting all kinds of candid, behind the scenes shots at Pittsburgh's fabled Forbes Field. His teammates didn't seem to mind posing for him, neither did the opposing players. His movies show an era when baseball was a simpler game. Baseball players react a little differently to a baseball player carrying a camera than they do a, you know, a media person, so. Lloyd Wainer also had the film camera rolling when the great New York Yankees played in Pittsburgh. That's the Bambino, Babe Ruth, taking some practice swings. When you really think about it, a 16 cam uh, millimeter camera back then it would have been pretty bulky. And to carry it around with your ball and your bat and all whatever else you carry around with, you know, he, he enjoyed it, obviously. The Wainers also took movies when they weren't playing baseball. In the off-season, when they returned to their hometown of Hera, near Oklahoma City, they'd reunite with family and friends. Many of the get-togethers were recorded on motion picture film. These big league baseball stars never forgot their Oklahoma roots. This is Lloyd's jersey. Jim Knight has become quite a collector of Wainer Brother memorabilia. Recently, he found jerseys, replicas of the ones his great uncles wore in Pittsburgh. He's glad the old movies have survived too, so that others can share memories of these baseball greats. Anybody I meet from Pittsburgh, I can say Wainer, and they go, whoa, I know them. So the, the legend's still there, the, the baseball fans uh, still remember them, and I just wish I could have seen them play.